let's start this up. I'm excited. All right, all right. So, um, I messed up a little bit. I had a little trouble messing. I messed up a bit, but uh, we're starting out. Uh, we have started Therian's uh, thing, so that that's the problem. Uh, he mostly just came in, and some people were like, Wow, is it that mysterious red dragon stone somewhere? It's up here, over this way. So I was like, okay, let's go. That That's what we missed, essentially. Uh, but I wanted to look at... Um, I wanted to tell. Uh, I basically got to every single, like, area. Like, I can true fast travel to all the places i mean i did extra stuff my favorite is that alfin's recommended level is 24 but this place is like level 27 so like that that's fun have fun getting yourself murdered if you if you try and do alfin's first um i have my group here i have my regular group Tressa for getting money, Elfin for being the best character ever, and Cyrus for looking at things. Um, and then I have the different jobs, and I have some decent equipment that I've been collecting. Not very, they're not like the best ones, but like, you know, it's decent for where we're going. But yeah, there we go. Let's start. Let's have fun. <laughs> Immediately. Perfect. Do -do -do. This must be the place. Yeah, my favorite was like when you first come here and it, you try to approach this place, it's like, oh, I shouldn't be here yet. So it's really funny that they just like, Therian is like, oh, I should probably not go into this location and steal from people. <gasps> oh no, guards! Making sure that no one losers uh, come. Of course. Of course it's guarded. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Twelve o'clock and all is well. A scholar with his own personal armed guard? Yeah, that's not suspicious or anything. No back door either. Hmm. I can't get a free pass anywhere these days. I'll swing by the tavern. Someone's bound to know something. There we go. Now for the tavern. I love that the game just says make for the tavern. I guess if you were just pressing, like skipping all the cutscenes, you wouldn't know. Now then. Now let's see. Who here looks like they know about our friend Orlik? Hello. How's business, my friend? Well, you see. Not good, I'm afraid. Hope you're faring better. <sighs> I wish I could say so, but it's been hard lately for us too. Oh. My condolences. Oh. I love that voice actor. Oh. Mine, too. Moving on. Pitch I just don't get those people. Locked away in that manner, surrounded by guards. Mm. It's strange, isn't it? Makes me wonder just what Orlik's up to in there. <gasps> wow. That's more like it. Hey. Mind if I have a seat? Hello? Not at all. Can I get you two a drink? What are you coming on to him? Ew. Alright then. That was mighty kind of you, stranger. What brings you here? You don't look like you're from around these parts. <laughs> I'm a wanderer, going wherever my feet take me. And there's nothing better than a tall ale and a good tail after a day of traveling. If you don't mind my asking, who's this Orlick fellow you were talking about? If you're that interested, we'll tell you all about him. Consider it thanks for the drinks. Well, the fact is... Orlick's the talk of the town right now. Truth is... He's a scholar, and one I dare say went off the deep end. Hold himself up in the middle of the edge of town. Word is he's doing some kind of research and hasn't come out since. 
Just so. I heard he's investigating a stone, but nobody knows what for. <laughs> Definitely sounds like he's got a few screws loose. <laughs> you got that right. He's the one you don't want to get involved with. Now that I think about it, though, didn't he have a research partner? Ah. Yeah, I heard he was another eccentric one. I think he's still doing research in town. Hmm. What's his name? I recall. Barnroom? Barhand? Barham? Yes, that's it. He worked in that matter with Orlick, but they went their separate ways after a disagreement. Is that so? I guess they were too much for each other to handle. Hot. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like it. Anyway, I hope that sates your curiosity, Wanderer. Thanks. It does. Thank you for your time, gentlemen. The Melton Egg? Now to track down this ball, hum. Man, that sound, that sound was really, really loud. Wait, no, miscellaneous, there we go, settings, not, not status. Octo Octopath Traveler. Wow, even then, it just seemed really loud for me. Oh well. Oh, let's do our best. Uh, actually, I wonder, now, when you do storylines and stuff, like, sometimes you'll get travel banter. There it is. We already missed one. It was with Tressa. And she was like, why don't you just talk to people and make lots of friends? Then they'll tell you all you need to know. And he's like, my friends die. And she's like, okay. Creepy. <laughs> Not a bad crowd, if I do say so myself. Hmm. Of course, the tavern where I used to ply my trade was far livelier. It's hard to rouse a crowd without a little entertainment, after all. That cr the quiet works for me, especially when I need to talk shop. Is that so? Still, I might as well perform one dance and lift the people's spirits. Huh. Hey, where do you think you're going? We need to keep a low profile. Ugh, can't a girl have a little fun? Oh, hey, and sometimes when you're in the tavern, sometimes your friends just appear. What do you got to say, Tressa? If you need someone with a keen eye for treasure, you know where to find me. Thanks, Tressa. Speaking of, let's put most of them back. Does Olby have something to say? Back with Cyrus then. Yeah, that's the problem. You have to switch your characters out back and forth, and it's really annoying. And I I remember that I was hoping that that would have been fixed for the PC release, but apparently not. Rip. So we gotta find what was it, Barnam or whatever? Oh, a curious antique. I must have done that when I was hanging out. Now then. Let's see if he's home. What? Who's there? Someone looking for a man named Barham. Let's hurry this up. I'm Barham. What business do you have with me? Is that so? I heard you used to be Orlick's research partner. Is that true? Yes, yes. That was a long, long ago. I have nothing to do with a man now, and I'm all the better for it. If that's all you came for, you can leave now. Goodbye. <laughs> Wait. Hear me out. Orlick has something I need. What? What's that? I'll give you a hint. It's the subject of his research. <sighs> the Ruby Dragonstone. Indeed. That's the one. I see. I surmise you plan to take it from him. Guilty as charged. <laughs> and you need my help. That's right. Mm-hmm. I see. So you came to ask me how to get into his place. 
<laughs> you scholars are quick on the uptake. Uh. Let's hurry this up. Very well, I'll give you the answer you seek. You'll need a password to enter. Oh. Uh -huh. Password is. <laughs> Presumptuous, aren't we? I'll tell you on one condition. Is that so? Let's hear it then. Get what I need for my experiment and we'll call it a deal. Sure. So sounds fair. What do you need? Pure water, filtered through the desert sands. The kind found only in the most pristine oases. Hmm. Silly me, I thought your demand was going to be reasonable. It is, you fool. A merchant from the Sunlands off comes to town selling this very water. However, the rarity doesn't come cheap. <laughs> Price is never my problem. Consider it done. Tr Tress is like, you're not seriously going to- Shut up, Tressa, shut up. Oh, hey, we got people here. Can I steal from them? Oh, no, not- Oh, I've already- These are just the random people from around town. I'll take that, thank you. Huh? Welcome, welcome. Come one, come all. I present to you the most precious and refreshing best bridge in the realm. Oasis water, all natural and free of even the slightest impurities. One sip and you'll taste the difference. You there, how about a drink? Thieving time. If you lead a thief to water. Uh, I can imagine Therian just, oh my goodness, look at the time. It's thieving time. I love how you can't do anything else because the only point is to get the oasis water. <laughs> that guy is going to disappear off the face of the planet after this. Give this person what they need? Yes. And that's that. I hope you're thirsty. Uh -huh. That was faster than I anticipated. Shoo, shoo. Now then. I fulfilled my half of the bargain. Now tell me the password. No. Now, now, your half is fulfilled when I say it's fulfilled. <sighs> I see what's happening here. I should hope so. I'll need a few more things for my experiment, if you'd be so kind. If you insist. Thieves are notorious for being kind. How can I help you? I require a Ravern scale. Can you procure one for me? I don't know. Where can I find one? If you want facts. They're sold in town from time to time. It's highly prized by scholars as a reagent and carries a price to match. Got it. Uh, I'm noticing a trend here, but yes, I can get it for you. Yes, yes. Good, I'm counting on you. As long as the guy doesn't flaunt it or anything. Look at me, I got a wyvern scale from some random other guy. If he ke keeps it on the down low, then at least it won't be traced back to him, maybe, question mark. Hey, merchant. Just random merchant out here. Welcome. You'll never believe what I found. It's a rarity, but it can be yours for a price. They won't even let you try to purchase it. I trust you won't be missing this. A lot of times, like, merchants and stuff will have, like, this is a really rare item, so it's gonna, like, you, like, it's gonna be, like, a 3% chance to get, but then mysteriously, like, these ones are perfectly easy to get, so, what, wouldn't he be watching it or something? I don't know. Don't ask questions. And that's that. I got what you asked for. Uh -huh. You're quite good at your craft. I need the password, not praise. Well, I need one more thing. Wonderful. Remind me, who's the crook here? 
That's a fine attitude if you, to have if you don't want a password. <sighs> okay, but this is the last one. Yes, yes. Yes, I promise. It's a special type of ore, a metallic in nature, but crystal clear. Once I have it, I can begin my experiment. <laughs> Music to my ears. I love how this one doesn't even have like a thing that's like specifically. <laughs> stealing here, stealing there, stealing pretty much anywhere. Heck, you thieves sure do work hard. Uh... And you wanted the best, right? You gotta have a massive stash of treasure hidden away. Let's just say I'm prepared for retirement. Uh, I, I see. Anyway, one more task and our job's done. Light at the end of the tunnel, eh? Hour? It's not like you're doing any thieving. Well, man, talk about a tough crowd. Anyway, when the job's done, what say we go hit the tavern? Huh. <laughs> sure. One mug, your treat. Alfin is just like, yes. Gotta get. Actually, I wonder, are there. Is anyone else gonna say anything? Very important. Always important to check. This is the dumbest thing. It really just it really does just break up the the story. And most likely someone else had it during the second or the first or second time. So we just missed out on the entirety of the story. Yeah, it's dumb. It really is. Ugh. So annoying. Oh well. Hello. Hey, look here. I carry only the finest quality minerals. It's not not anymore. Smell you later. And that's that. I got what you asked for, for the last time. Here. Catch. Careful. C uh, careful with that. Anyhow, thanks. At least I can be, at last I can begin my grand experiment. <laughs> Aren't you forgetting something, old man? You promised me a password. <sighs> cool your heels. The experiment comes first. I hope you don't think you can swindle a swindler. Wrong. Don't be ridiculous. Just be patient and I'll uphold my half of the bargain. If you want facts. Orlick and I have known each other since our years at the Academy. We acquired that manor as a place to continue our research. But he changed after coming across that dragon stone. It was almost like he was possessed, his life consumed by his research. He wouldn't let anyone near him, not even me. Huh. <sighs> That's why I want to help you get that stone away from him. But not, but it's not meant to be held by our hands. <laughs> huh. The password is the truth of all things. Well, I'll be Truth dead. Truth of all things. Well, that's easy enough to remember. Hmm. Yes. And take this with you, too. Nani? Ching! This is... This is a key. True. Observant. I see. You use those materials to make this. Yes, yes. You're a natural born researcher, boy. Now the password will get now the password will get you into the mansion. But the door to the laboratory can only be opened with that key. Hmm. Makes you think he doesn't even want he doesn't want anyone getting in, not even an old friend like you. <sighs> yes, we may have disagreed from time to time, but Orlik is still like a brother to me. 
My warnings may ha have been nothing but noise to him, but I wouldn't be much of an older brother if I didn't nag from time to time. Passion is important in our line of work, but there's a fine line between that and obsession, and Orlok's crossed that line. Hmm. So this moving friendship, or perhaps brotherly love, is why you're so willing to help me? <laughs> I wonder. Perhaps it's jealousy or hatred that's come to drive me. But those bygone days are precious to me even now. I know what I feel is true. Oh, really? Tugs the old heartstrings. But my own reason... My own reasons are more than enough to go through with this. Thanks. Hmm. Friends, brothers, partners. Hmm. Why could... What has made Therian not care about that anymore? Oh! Flashback! All right. I think we're in the clear. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha, those Siano bastards finally got what they deserved. Ugh. Always strutting around like they bleeding over the place. Oh, I wish I could see their boats when they realize someone beat them to it. No matter how hard they look now, they won't find our treasure. <laughs> Something this rare would be wasted on them anyway. <laughs> you said it. Now we'll just sell the gem and... Hmm. Wait. Hmm? Something wrong. Uh... Where are the gold coins we stole? We said we'd split the spoils. <laughs> <laughs> Sharp as a tack, aren't you? It's not much, so I thought I'd just hold on to it and buy you a tiddly later. I see. I see. Then let's celebrate with this tonight. <gasps> yeah, let's. All right. But don't let your guard down. The Cianos will come for revenge at some point. They call themselves thieves, but they'll resort to violence if need be. Thanks. I know. Thanks for looking out, partner. Now then. No problem. Now let's get moving. <laughs> so they were they met each other as kids and then they grew up to being friendlies i swear scholars have to be the most pig-headed folk around not exactly there's some truth to no i'm afraid i must protest you must understand that not all scholars are like the master here I can see there are stubborn types obsessed with their research and blind to all else, but those are but there are broad-minded thinkers too who f freely seek wisdom and truth in all of its forms, like myself, for example. Uh, I see. Let me rephrase myself. By all means, my friend. Scholars are some of the most pompous and pedantic people I've ever had the joy of meeting. Now, that's hardly an improvement. Allow me to make a counter-argument. Case in point. Now, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> Poor Cyrus. Don't be mean to me. <laughs> All right, let's do it. gotta tell him the password what was it the truth in all things hold on there what business do you have here hmm there's no need to sneak around now that i have the password if i play my cards right i can walk right in hey i have a passage for orlick materials for his experiment oi hear anything about a delivery nah not me Hmm. That's odd. Maybe the message just got lost somewhere. Anyway, he said it was urgent, so I rushed over. 
What's the password? The truth of all things. All right, you may pass. Much obliged. Oh. Time to get to work. Where would we be without guards? Let's go. Dungeon time. Hey, I knew it. Danger level 22. Thanks for telling me now. Wait, where am I going? That looks like it's the way on. There's treasure over here. Oop, oh, money, money, money. 3,000, though. That's like barely anything. A lot of the stuff I've been buying now is are like 30,000 leaves. So it's like, hmm, 3,000? Not, not cutting it. Yeah, I thought so. Thanks for that. Here I go. And this is why you bring Cyrus to everything. Oh, okay, so I guess it's just both ways. Yeah, 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 yeah. so that's above. Up from here. Oh. Hmm. This is probably the way on, but there's stuff down there. I have to, and now I have to go back down. Ah! Uh, at least we're getting free money. Thanks, Tressa. Let's see what you got. I appreciate it. Really? What is the logical course of action? Great. 
bunch. There was something down this way. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to be a, a, an archway. But apparently not. Ah, uh, one treasure. It's going to be like a healing grape. Totally worth. Not worth. Want a tango, huh? Out of my way. Steal! Ah! SP is so good! You just steal it! And you can keep going forever! Yeah! Never stop stealing SP! Ow, what the crap! Oh, flames! Rage strong! Here goes nothing! Level slash! <laughs> My turn. Nice. Don't start things you can't finish. We should probably steal some more SP later, though. And I noticed up uh, more money. Thanks, Tressa. I noticed in the the radar this is the way to go because of the green little green housey telling me it's this way. Out of my way. Ah. Huh. Nom nom nom. What? Where's the nearest oh, tavern? Because he only had like two hit points left. Uh lame. Gotta be careful about that. Lightning amulet. Reduces lightning damage taken. Probably never gonna use it. Because I never know if an enemy is, like, gonna use lightning. How am I supposed to know? I mean, it might be nice for, like, a speedrunner or something, but I can assure you that there are better things to equip in when speedrunning. What's this way? Time to teach you a lesson. Time to tip the scales. Wait. Here we go. Out of my way. I appreciate it. Really? Lame. An interesting dilemma. Oh, wait, no, 
boy. Here we go. I bought some injurious dust. There we go. How do you like this? Nice. <laughs> Much better. An interesting dilemma. So much to learn. Boss. Use well, the key. I'll be damned. Use the key, Therian. So this is the door Barnum was talking about. Barham was talking about. It doesn't look like it has any ordinary lock, that's for sure. But this crystal key should do the trick. Emphasis on should. Hey. Mm -hmm. I should probably. There we go. Everyone gained a level recently, but Tressa would like it. The Ruby Dragonstone. The Ruby Dragonstone. That's exactly what I said. One down, two to go. Oh, this is cut. This is a voice cutscene. I can take a break. That's far enough, thief. <gasps> You must be Orlick. I assume you heard the rumors and came to steal my dragonstone. But filthy thieves such as yourself could never appreciate its true value. <gasps> is it true value? What is he talking about? <gasps> Wait. Barham put you up to this that nagging, patronizing coward, Barham. This research is pointless, Orlick. Enough with the Dragonstone, Orlick. I'll decide when enough is enough. <laughs> oh, that voice is perfect. Mark my words, boy. This stone is mine, and you will never have it. I beg to differ. I couldn't care less about its true value. But I need to get that stone back to its rightful owner, and that's not you. <gasps> Who did you care about rightful owners? Well, he does, because he's got that fool's bangle on him. This stone should be in the hands of someone intelligent. Someone who can appreciate its mysteries. Someone like yourself? Precisely. This beautiful stone requires research. And I'm the only one who can do it. It sounds like you can't trust anyone else to get the job done. Why should I? I never said you should. I know how it feels. <gasps> Don't pretend you understand! Enough with this thoughtless prattle! I have work to do! Let's get this over with. Here goes nothing! Nothing! <laughs> 
How do you like this? I guess weak to dark. An interesting Would mean color. not weak to light. <sighs> Let the night consume all. Kind of getting pissed right now. Ah, so much to learn. There we go. Over here. There you go. What is the logical course of action? I appreciate it. Really? Thanks for the SP. Here goes the oh, Alrighty! Level Slash! An interesting dilemma. Are you serious? Bodyguard, why? much for him to do at this point. I guess just get things. Oh, okay. There we go. Next. Ah, a 
Tempest of Pine Shell Ray. What is the logical course of action? Let's do this. Still have so much to learn. Try this. Tempest of Ice Shell Rain! Let's do this! Heal! Bring it on! That'll do her! Bring it on! <sighs> I see through the defenses. <laughs> An interesting dilemma. Here goes nothing. Ha! Ah! The lion shall die. Bring it on! Try this! Out of my way. I appreciate it. Really? An interesting... 
interesting dilemma. My focus is unparalleled. Here we go. What is the logical course of action? I see the defenses. Let's do this. Uh, heal. <sighs> I'm ready for you. I appreciate it. Really. Interesting dilemma. So much to learn. What to do? Bring it on. Yeah. How do you like this? An interesting dialogue. Ah. the logical course of action. Let's try this. How do you like this? <laughs> All right. How do you like this? Out of my way. <laughs> An interesting dynamic. <laughs> ah! A great inferno to stop the land. Not bad. A passing Bested by a thief. How disgraceful. Hmm. 
Since you won't be doing much more research, I'll just take this. And now, back to Boulderfall. I'm sure Heathcote's got new orders for me. Hooray. I'm back. I'm so glad to see you safe, Mr. Therion. I brought the Dragonstone. This is indeed the Ruby Stone, without a doubt. You have my gratitude. He is simply upholding his half of the deal, milady. He deserves no such thanks. After all, he has yet to return the two remaining stones. I think he's earned the removal of the band. Stop and think about what you're saying. I beg your pardon? You can't guarantee I'll fulfill my promise if you remove this now. I believe you would. And why is that? You don't strike me as someone who would abandon responsibility. And you strike me as someone with too much faith in people. Take it from me. No matter how much you trust someone, they will betray you. So do yourself a favor and build your walls up higher before you get hurt. Mr. Therion? Please, milady, that's quite enough. Though I hate to admit it, he's right. It's best not to remove the band just yet. So, where's the next stone? After a bit of digging, I found it to be in Wellspring. Any idea where in Wellspring? That town is home to a black market. How does he know about the black market? Only those involved with the business are supposed to know. I knew he was no ordinary butler. The Emerald Dragonstone is being sold there. Or so my sources say. I'll be on my way then. Good luck out there, Mr. Therion. You don't need to see me off again. It's a waste of time for both of us. But... Farewell. Please, don't burden yourself with him, Miss Ravis. Even that man has dignity to uphold. Dignity? Though he may live an unscrupulous life, his skills as a thief keep him alive. Naturally, he has pride and confidence in these skills, 
but we use them against him. And I can imagine he feels great frustration when shown compassion and consideration by the very ones who duped him. If he did not feel such, I would not think him suitable for the job. I... I see. He is a man with a lot of pride. Milady? My apologies, Heathcote, but I can't help thinking of that lonesome look on his face. It reminded me of myself back then. Is that so? Yes. His words may have been harsh, but I could tell that his true feelings were different. 